Hello students. Today we will study chapter number 12, Continents, North and South America and Europe. In this chapter we will study about three continents, North and South America and Europe continents and it is the chapter of Geography. Geography means the study of places and its environment. The land of our earth is divided into seven continents. Means, हमारे earth में जो ज़मीन है वो seven continents में divide की गई है और continents countries में divide की गए है और countries states में divide की गई है. Now let's study about the continent North America. This is the image of our earth. Here you can see the earth is divided into seven continents shown by different colors. Now we will study about North America which is shown in green blinking era. ये आप जो फिगर देख रहे हैं वो सेवन कॉन्टिनेंट्स के हैं अभी हम नॉर्थ अमेरिका के बारे में पढ़ेंगे This is the map of North America continent and it consists of three countries Canada, United States and Mexico. ये जो आपको मैप दिख रहा है वो नॉर्थ अमेरिका का है एंड इट इज़ डिवाइडेड इनटू थ्री कंट्रीज कैनेडा यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स एंड मेक्सिको नॉर्थ अमेरिका एक्सटेंड्स फ्रॉम द आर्टिक ओशियन इन द नॉर्थ टू पनामा इन द साउथ नॉर्थ अमेरिका नॉर्थ में आर्टिक ओशियन से लेकर साउथ में पनामा तक फैला हुआ है इन दिस फिगर You can see North Pole is shown by red blinking dot, Tropic of Cancer is shown by green blinking line and Mexico is shown by orange blinking A. North Pole passes from the north of Canada. In the same way, the Tropic of Cancer passes through central Mexico. Canada ke north mein North Pole of Earth hai, vaise hi Mexico ke center se Tropic of Cancer pass hota hai. North America is spread over 2.44 lakhs square kilometer. Means North America ka jo land area hai, wo 2.44 lakhs square uh, kilometer tak fela hua hai. It's cover 16 percentage of the land area of the world. Aur wo world mein jitna bhi total land area hai, usme se 16 percentage North America ne cover kiya hai. The natives are known as Red Indians. Waha ki people ko Red Indians kehte hai. Great Lakes Systems It is made up of five lakes. North America mein Great Lakes System hai and which is made up of five lakes. Superior, Michigan, Euro, Erie and Ontario. The Great Lakes contains one-fifth of world fresh surface water. Means earth mein jitna bhi fresh water hai, uska one-fifth ye Great Lakes mein paya jata hai. Making them the largest system of fresh water on earth. Prairies means vast fertile basins. Now let's study about the climate of North America. The climate of North America varies dramatically. Means us mein bahut sare variation hai. It can be arctic cold to equatorial heat. Waha par North Pole ki taraf jo arctic ocean hai. उसके जैसी कोल्ड या इक्वेटर जैसी हीट भी हो सकती है इन मैनी एरियाज देर इज एक्सट्रीमली कोल्ड एंड ड्राई क्लाइमेट नॉन एज टंड्रा क्लाइमेट टाइप ऑफ क्लाइमेट बहुत सारे एरियाज में एक्सट्रीमली कोल्ड यानी बहुत ज़्यादा ठंडी और ड्राई क्लाइमेट यानी सूखा क्लाइमेट होता है जिसे टंड्रा टाइप ऑफ क्लाइमेट कहा गया है टोर्नाडोज आर कॉमन इन द सेंट्रल पार्ट ऑफ द यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स Now let's study about the country Canada. Ottawa is the capital of Canada. Ice hockey is the national game of Canada. It has longest coastline in the world. Canada's river are famous for salmon fish. Canada is the world's largest producer of asbestos. Asbestos is a mineral. Now let's study about United States. Tallest mountain peak in the US is Mountain McKinley in the Alaska Range. US ka sabse tall mountain uh, McKinley hai jo Alaska Range mein hai. 
Eskimos live here in igloo. This type of house is known as igloo. USA, United States of America leads the world in development of transportation, especially roadways. There are superhighways and freeways. Freeways are express highways without any toll booths. Now let's study about the continent South America. Fourth biggest triangular continent in the western hemisphere of the world. It covers 13% of the total land area of the world. Ye continent ne 13% ka land cover kiya hai. Andes is the world's highest mountain range outside of Asia. Pink blinking line is shown as the Andes mountain. It is 6,000 meter high mountain. South America has over 200 volcanoes and Ecuador is one of the many countries that has most volcanoes. South America mein 200 se zyada volcanoes hai aur us mein Ecuador country hai jis mein sabse zyada volcanoes hai. Chimborazo is the example of inactive volcano and Cotopaxi is an example of active volcano. Amazon is the world's longest river. Pure world mein Amazon sabse longest river hai. Titicaca Lake is the largest freshwater lake of Bolivia. 275 meters deep, it is the highest lake. Ye sabse highest lake hai. Now let's study about the climate, vegetation and the wildlife of South America. The central part of South America is torrid region, high temperature and frequent rainfalls. Means in this type of region there is high temperature and frequent rainfalls. And in southern part like Chile and Peru, cold and dry, there is cold and dry. Climate Alfalfa grass of Pampas is well known. Rare species of gods and sheep like the alpaca and the lima are found there. Argentina and Brazil are the leading producer of wheat and sugarcane. Means Argentina or Brazil mein wheat or sugarcane sabse zyada produced hoti hai. Now let's study about the country Brazil of South America. People speak Portuguese language. Anaconda, a large snake, is found in Amazon rainforest. Anaconda, jo sabse bada snake hai, wo Amazon rainforest mein paya jata hai. Brasilia is the capital of the country. Brasilia, country ka capital hai. Now let's study about the country Argentina. Triangular in shape. It is situated near Andes mountains, which is shown by pink blinking line. Argentina is triangular in shape. People speak Spanish. Its capital is Buenos Aires. Now let's study about the continent Europe. Biggest peninsula of the world separated from the Asia by the Ural mountain. Peninsula means the land covered with the water. It is spread over 16 lakh square kilometer and 64 crore people live in this continent. Rhine, Volga, Danube are the main rivers. Norway and Sweden located to north of Europe has grey soil while southern Europe has dark brown Chernozem soil. Now let's study about the country Russia of Europe. Moscow is the capital of Russia. 25% of the total production of wheat of the world is produced in Russia. Means 25% wheat ka total produce Russia mein hota hai.
Now let's study about the country England. It is situated on the seaside having modern ideology and technology. It is shown by orange blinking area in the map of Europe. 4% of the land of England is covered by forest. Coal is the main mineral produced here. England ka 4% land area forest se covered hai. Now let's study about the country France of Europe. Paris is the capital of France. It is shaped like hexagon. The shape you can see is hexagon figure. River Seine, the longest river of France, is used as waterways. River Seine. फ्रांस की सबसे लॉन्गेस्ट रिवर है और वो वाटरवेज में भी यूज होती है मॉन्ट ब्लैंक द हाईएस्ट पीक ऑफ वेस्ट यूरोप इज लोकेटेड इन फ्रांस यूरोप का सबसे हाईएस्ट पीक फ्रांस में लोकेटेड है नाउ लेट्स स्टडी अबाउट द कंट्री जर्मनी जर्मनी इज अ लैंड लॉक्ड कंट्री लैंड लॉक मींस इट इज लैंड सराउंडेड बाय लैंड Berlin is its capital city. Germany is the leading country of the world in engineering industries. Thanks for watching.